All right, guys, welcome back to another video. I am out here with James once again. We are at Spanish Landing. You guys are wondering, why do I have waiters on? Well, guess what? You guys have been asking, all you guys have been asking, where's the flow tube videos? Are you guys ever going to flow tube again? Are you ever going to flow tube again? Sure enough, check it out. I don't know if y'all saw that, but yeah. We're going to be flow tubing Spanish Landing right behind me. It is 6 a.m. We got here at 5.30. We got everything rigged up, all pumped up. It's been a while. It's been two years since I float tubed ever. And uh, shout out to my old buddy for... <laughs> Funny story is that James found my old float tube on offer up. And he shot me a message. He's like, hey, yo, your float tube. The guy I sold it to a long time ago, Adam bought it and used it once and he had it up online i guess that day james saw it i was like oh shoot i may as well cop it back so i copped it back and sure enough i am here spanish landing ready to tube that little marina basin whatever it is right behind me so i don't know what to expect i heard spanish has been good i heard spanish has been bad we are fishing incoming tide gonna be throwing the basic shit jig paras plastics and some other stuff maybe some stuff i want to show you guys that i got but if you guys like flow tubing you guys want to see more comment below let me know what you're thinking or any other suggestions of where to fish and where to float to so stay tuned and let's get this morning going all right let's go how the audio is going to be but we're on the water i'm actually going to finesse see what happens i'm gonna ned rig it and see what happens finesse you know what baits hey googan baits <laughs> had these laying around for quite some time the rattling drift the rattling net is what it's called kind of dope how it comes in the clamshell pretty cool the color i'm gonna be throwing is rattling net smelt pattern Let's see if that gets bit i don't know i don't even know about it we'll find out this body's pretty much will eat and bite anything You guys see that? Look at that, peeking over downtown San Diego. That was you? Yeah. Like that, huh? Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'll take it. Dinks, big ones, small ones, little ones, giants. I'll take them all. As long as not my finger or my arm or my flow tube at the end of the line, I'm happy. And grass and a rock. Okay, mom. <laughs> Always got to check your pressure, guys, if you're tubing. Yeah, James. Playing with your feelings, huh? Yeah. 
saw my line pop. That was crazy. I didn't even feel it. Really? Yeah, I watched my line. <laughs> saw my line before the rod even went. On the net. Boom. Oh, whoa, he's bigger than I thought. There you go, on the net. This guy is 12 inches. <laughs> I'll take it. Biggest one today so far. Here, James. This net rig is putting in work. That rattle. I don't encourage you guys to smoke cigarettes, all right? I just mean. And I do throw my trash in the bucket behind me, just in case you guys are wondering. Oh, nice. Digging. Let me know you want some. I got plenty. <laughs> Feels like a good one. Yeah, pretty fat. Again, on a net. This guy's pretty fat. It's a good pound. Right there. Let him go. Yeah, I'm gonna cast and fly off this too. <laughs> <laughs> I thought about that too. I was like, man, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's too far forward. <laughs> oh, I messed up on that one. Follow through on your cast. You won't do that. <laughs> looking backwards see if any boat was coming I got smashed cranked on it get away <laughs> <laughs> yeah that but the last one that I hooked up to was like that too there you go And he's pooping all over my hand. Oh, you ass. Poop all over my hand. Little guy. 
Yeah, double up. James right there, he's on one. He's on a way better one. Got a lot of fish. Got some decent 20 sized plus, ones. Huh? 20, yeah, 30. 20 plus. Experience. It's been your what, two year mark? Two years. Yeah, it's been two years since I flow tubed, and it's my old flow tube that I got back. Well, guys, it was interesting. It was tiring. The, the trek back in was rough because the current started just not, not letting me come back in. <laughs> it was like, you need to stay your ass out there and continue fishing. But no, we made it back. We caught about 25, 30 fish all together. Ned rigged the Guggen squad, rattling Ned, put in work at the beginning. Then we switched over to the Jika rig. Jikpara spin was not getting no love whatsoever. No love at all. But the Jikpara 10 gram micro irons, I, I got one, yeah, I think I got one on that. And then we attempted to go for halibut with the bucktails. We saw bait busting around us, but nothing was committing. No barracuda, no corvina, no halibut. But all in all, it's part of the game. We're out here Spanish landing. First time float tubing in two years. Shout out to Adam for uh, shooting it back to me. If you're watching this, Adam, thanks a lot. That pretty much sums it up. I mean, everything I use in this video, be sure to check the description below, all right? Everything, I mean, rods, reels, music, line, all that stuff. Description below, check that out. And if you guys like these float tubing videos, like I mentioned earlier, give me some ideas where to float, where to fish, where's a good place to launch, and etc. Share your thoughts below. You don't have to. You can shoot me a DM. But you guys can find me on Instagram for that one. But other than that, dude, it was fun. Slow tubing. I'm definitely going to do it again. And we're going to try different spots. You know, Shelter Island. Maybe um, Glorietta Bay. Coronado Caves. We're going to try all those spots out down the line. Hopefully this winter, uh, the bite will pick up good for us. And maybe we'll land some mondos. But other than that, guys, I'm going to close it out right there. I am beat. It, the sun came out, bite died. My calves are huge. I'm talking about <laughs> ox huge. <laughs> but I'm gonna sum it up right there. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. If you guys are new to this channel, consider subscribing. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs down if you don't. But it'll help me out a lot if you guys give me a thumbs up. But other than that, if you guys don't wanna show me some love, then it is what it is. But as always, good fishing and peace the hell out. Yeah.